Hey, what is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button below. I would love to have you. Um, so today I am going to do a mini Target haul. Lennox and I went through the store and we picked up a few things. So I am going to get started and show you what I got. I picked up a pair of sunglasses at Target. I actually ordered these offline. They were $14.99 and I love them. They are UV protected and the reason I needed sunglasses, I didn't need them as much on the East Coast, but the sun is very, very bright here. Like I can't even like look up past the ground because it just hurts your eyes. So I needed some type of sunglasses and I can confirm that yes, they are UV protected. Like I feel like I have full protection when I'm outside. Like I can keep my eyes open and it doesn't bother me. So this is what they look like. They have different colors. They have a few different shapes that are $14.99. So I will link these and you can check out and see which color or shape you prefer for yourself. But I would definitely recommend for the price. Okay, so going along with my summer theme, a lot of people around here wear these sun hats. So like I feel when I take my son to the playground, I feel like I'm the only one without one. But I feel awkward wearing one because I've never worn one before and on the East Coast, I feel like I didn't see as many people with them on. However, they are very common here and I know why. So like there's not much humidity here, it's all sun. So like if I'm completely like shaded, it feels so much cooler. It's not like the humidity is making me, my head sweat within the hat. It's like, I feel like my shoulders are cool. My whole body is cool. So I love this. It's a Smith and Hawken. Um, so it has this like really pretty floral brim on the inside. I know you can't see it when you're wearing it, but I just think it looks really pretty um they advertise it as a gardening hat i call it a sun hat i can't really put it on because i have a clip in the back of my head right now but kind of just sits like that it keeps me cool i look somewhat fashionable and this was also 15 dollars. so definitely would recommend it's really really nice it's like good material the only thing is you're not supposed to get it wet so or you can't wash it so i'll just you know leave it at that but so far it's done the job for me and i would recommend it if you live in a place where it gets sunny often i also have paired the hat with the sunglasses in the past so i've done this and it's like amazing like if i'm at the beach it's like i feel shaded i don't have any issues seeing with both my hat and my sunglasses on so i have like full sun protection note to self i should not take lennox with me in target anymore like it's it's nice having him because he finally keeps his mask on and like we have a good time he actually like sits in the cart wears his mask but now he like wants everything that he sees and i'm like okay so we haven't gone to the store in a while so once in a while you know i'll treat him because he hasn't gone out and he is behaving it's like oh my gosh you're dangerous you need to stay home next time but anyway i picked him up a few pieces of clothing i don't have a ton for him i've mentioned this before but my sister used to give me clothes from my nephews like hand-me-downs but now that we live far away like we have to like start out fresh so as i go to the store i pick up little by little i picked up more of these i guess they're like jogger shorts um they were four dollars so I will link them. He has these in like many other colors. He has tan, he has blue. These are like a grayish charcoal color with green strings. So I got that and then I thought we could pair them with, I am obsessed with this shirt. I'm about to show you. I thought we could pair it because of the strings with this alligator crocodile top, whichever you like to call it. It is so soft. That's like what I love about it the most. It's just like really good material. And I think this one was 450. Um, it has like this little yellow brim in the back and all his stuff I purchased in a 3T. But I like the color. It looks super cute on him. I'll link a picture um, if I can. I took one this weekend. But I definitely would recommend because the material just feels so, so soft. And then one other top I got him. I think this one was also $4.50. I think it's called a raglan or raglan shirt. I have it linked, but it was titled as like raglan top. But I like it because it's like casual but i feel like you could also dress it up if you put it with like khakis or whatever this is also a 3t and it has like the light blue in the middle and then the sleeves and the neckline are in navy blue so i think i also put this on him and he looked really cute but i don't have a picture of him with it and then lastly i have four pajamas that are long pants and then short sleeves but i only have like one pair of 
pajamas for him with shorts. So I wanted to get one more. So I got another set, let him pick it out. I let him pick in between crabs or trucks. And of course he went with the trucks. So the one set has this top with, it has like a cement mixer, bulldozer, dump truck, you know, just screams, little boy, screams Lennox's name. It came as a set, these pants came with it. So it's the same design on the bottom. And then also within the same set, so I think I purchased this all for like $14.99 or $11.99 or something, came this really cute um, rhinoceros with the sunglasses and it's like he's wearing a bathing suit on the bottom. So here are the bottoms. And then the top is a tank top, which he's actually never worn one of these to bed, but I thought it was really cute. And then that way I'm covered. Now I have two pair of short pajamas. Um, I don't need really more than that because I feel like it doesn't get as hot here. Like we've only turned our air condition on like once ever, um, just because we don't have the humidity. So when the sun goes down, like I think he's good. It's it for the clothes for Lennox. I, I showed in a previous vlog clothes for myself. I didn't actually show them in like a Target haul. So I'm gonna grab them quick and just show you the two outfits I got for myself. And maybe if you're looking for something for the summer, it will give you an idea. This top is from a new day. I, you know, I'm not a real big fan of their t-shirts. I like uh, Universal Threads better just because I feel like their shirts hold up better. I always get like holes and stuff in the New Day t-shirts, but this I feel like is really well made. It almost has like that linen-like material. Um, I will link a picture of myself in here just so you can see, but this is something that I purchased. And then another thing that I love, and you won't be able to see it like in a full screen here, is this black skirt. And it's a white skirt with black polka dots. And I will also link a picture of myself wearing it. It is just, Beautiful. I feel like it was $27.99, but definitely well worth it. It's like the first dress up outfit I bought since I've had my son and he's almost three and I just, I love it. Like I would recommend it to anybody. So here it's like a flowy pleated skirt. I pull it up a little bit um, and then I wear it with a black tank top, but would definitely recommend this. I actually still have the tags on it. So I purchased this in a large, I would recommend true to size or sizing down. It is a little bit big on myself, but I really loved it and they didn't have any other size. So this one is $27.99. So I will show you a picture here. It is just adorable, I love it. Okay, so if you're a boy mom, if not, you can just skip on through. I have been eyeing up these motorcycles. So he had one, like a small motorcycle that I purchased um, a few months ago and I saw they had all these big ones and I was gonna save it for potty training. However, they didn't have them online. It says like in-store purchase only. So unfortunately I can't even link them, but I feel like there are limited editions for one, because you can't get it online. It's only in-store. And for two, when I went back, they only had one left. This was like the only one. And a few weeks ago they had like 20. So, you know, I obviously picked it up with him there. So I had to give it to him. I couldn't save it for potty training, but I would love to get my hands on some more of these. My son is obsessed with motorcycles. Um, so if you're a boy mom, this I think was $12.99, which is a better deal than the smaller ones. The smaller ones are I think $7.99, which is just like way overpriced. But they also come with like a display stand. So when he gets older, if he wants to collect them, whatever, that's something he can do. But yeah, I'm disappointed. This is the only one they had left. I was hoping to grab like one or two more colors. And something else I have been wanting to get him is this... Melissa and Doug numbers one to 20. So he knows one through 10, but I have been trying to get him or find a way to get him to learn 11 through 20. And I just feel like it's hard to do like just writing on a piece of paper that he needs something more tactile and fun. So it's really been working. And within a few days, like we've made a lot of progress. So we actually, what we do is we make a train. We set up like a wooden train and then we take the number one by one and we set them along the train and we say the numbers as you know we do it or we've also like lined them all up and then kind of done like a domino and as we're lining them up I'll go through the numbers so I really wanted to get this to teach him up to number 20 and it's definitely working so if you have a little one that you're trying to teach you know past 10 to or even 1 through 10 I would recommend and it's really nice that they're super chunky so it's like easy to grasp on. They don't have the knobs, but I'm telling you they're like chunky enough that you can pick them up easily. 
So they have the number underneath in the same corresponding color, and then it has the corresponding amount of objects around each number. So here is the Melissa and Doug number puzzle. I believe we spent $17.99. I will link it for you guys. Lastly, I'm so excited about this. I was looking for like more educational things for him and I happened to come across that Target has sensory bins. Like they will sell you the entire bin, everything you need in the kit. They have different ones. So I'm about to show you, we purchased the space one and then they have, I think an ice cream one, which I don't know why I didn't get it. Cause I think he would have loved it. It comes with like the sprinkles and toppings and has kinetic sand. I think that's why I didn't get it because we have kinetic sand already, but that would be my next choice. They have like a dinosaur one and then we purchased the space one. So they are under $20, which is amazing for what it comes with. It comes with this whole container. So I did not purchase the container separately. And then it comes with all these little rocks. I'm going to turn the camera around so you can see. So it comes with all these colorful moon rocks, I guess you can call them. There's green, black, pink, and blue. Um, it comes with this scooper so it has like little sifter on the bottom and you cannot you know strain them because the beads are too big so i'm not sure why but just to let you know like you won't be able to strain the beads through that will not work comes with this little astronaut saturn so it's really great for teaching your child you know about the different planets and i like how they kept it simple they only have like the main planets so they have like a moon they have Earth, they have Saturn, and then they have a few stars. So you're, they're not overwhelmed with all the planets. And then these are like, a, they call them fluffy ball planets or something. It's just like make-believe. Um, and then here's glow-in-the-dark stars. You can lay them like that. You can stand them straight up. They have these little sensory spirals. It comes with one, two, three, four, five. And then I just realized, so it also comes with like these tongs, these pinchers, and it looks like Lennox misplaced them because I do not see them here. But it comes with those as well, and they're very easy to use. So when he pinches um, these balls, he has no issue at all doing that um, just because they made it very user-friendly for children. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know what my child did with the blue tongs, but you'll see it in the picture I'll link below. It shows everything that's included. It includes all of this including the box um, and then the tongs, which actually there's a picture here on the outside. So I'll quick show you. This is what it looks like right there. Very cute. It, it promotes sensory development, fosters imaginative play and develops fine motor skills. I've already let him play with it on the floor in his room just because like these rocks are so big, I can pick them up easily. Um, but if you believe your child will put anything in their mouth, please by any means don't. I think the age is three plus on it, but he's done fine with it and it's promoted a lot of learning and learning about space and uh, just has a great time with it. I will link all of them below, not just the space ones. You can give, you can check them all out. So that concludes today's video. Thank you so much for watching today's video. As always, I will link everything in the description box below. That way you can check out all these items. I'm from Target, if you enjoyed today's video and wanna see more like it in the future, please give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And until next time, we'll see you later. Bye guys.